Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Risk of Rain. Today we're going to be jumping in as the character known as House. This character seems crazy. Basically, he is random. He has a lot of luck-based things. We're going to be jumping in with the explosive shot, the jackpot, the uh, snake eyes, the king, the wi and the wild card. So, you can pause and read those if you want. But yeah, apparently this guy's pretty crazy. Very luck-based. Uh, all sorts of stuff can happen. We, It's all based on drawing cards and all sorts of shit. We've got this big old thing um, on our screen here. So, our regular attack. Ooh, damn. Yeah, I like that explosion. I don't know how often we fire the explosion. So, it seems like we just fire... It seems like maybe the skills that I selected don't actually matter. My guy is having trouble reloading right now. Okay, I used a skill and it reloaded. I am very confused right now. Okay. Yeah, I don't, I don't really know what's going on, I'll be honest. Snake eyes there. Okay, so the icons on our screen denote what type of bullet we're going to fire. Snake shot ones hurt us, I see that now. And then we have to use one of these. We load one special round. Okay, there you go. I like that. We load another card here. We've got a few more shots. This is very strange. I've got to say, this guy is all sorts of weird. But um, I quite like it thus far. It's it's very interesting, to say the least. Um, I think it's going to take some getting used to, most definitely. Okay, get some regular shots in there. It's just kind of interesting that we have to use our abilities to, um... We have to use our abilities in order to reload. I find that very strange. It's like, look, I... Oh, wait. I've got unlimited magazine right now. I'm not exactly sure why that is. But now we're, now we're stuck. Now we can't fire, so we're going to have to go like that. That's the explosive shot. That explosive shot's amazing. I love that. Wow, here's a chest. Tri-tip dagger seems reasonably good for this guy. And I don't know what my green shot is. I'd like it if the icon in the middle was a little bit smaller, though. It's a little bit distracting. Okay, so we've got two purples here, which I think the purples are the bad ones. So if I, if I go and pop mouse two here, it'll give me some bad. Okay, spawns a bunch of powerful enemies. Okay, that's what we got there. And we can use this card here to fire some missiles. And we've added some bleed. Extra damage to bosses, that sounds good. And we got random effect completely here. This is all sorts of wacky. We have an unlimited mag for a little while here. Not quite so sure why that is. I think mouse two here is heal. Yeah, nice one. Okay, so basically, wait, we didn't we didn't really choose the skills. They're just all the skills that are plausible, and we've just got to kind of learn them. I'm seeing. Oh god, I I wasted that. Okay, this is like one of every type of shot I see. I need more uh, chests here, and I think I'm going to need items. Okay, mouse two here. That's another heal of sorts. That loaded two shots. That loaded snake shots. Bollocks. Okay, this is very, very strange. Okay, now we've got the rainbows again. I definitely think I'm going to end up dying as this guy pretty swiftly, I'll be honest. Ooh, slow down nearby enemies projectiles is pretty good. Get that healing going. Getting gold on critical hits, that's potentially kind of good. We'll see how that works out. That's the explosion, I love that. Okay, we've got a chest down there as well. 
Oh, we can put out some real damage sometimes. So I think the green ones are the ones we always want to go for, really, if we if we get the option. The green ones seem like the best. Right. Boom, boom, and boom. And we're doing good damage right now. So green again. It says reload. It does. I don't think it's anything special though. But we've got an active item here. I like the idea of that. And then mouse two for that one, I guess. Pack up and move it, so not actually that bad. Keep the rest of my mag here. Okay, we got all reds. Reds and greens both seem good. Okay, I think we're all out of items, to be honest. I'm not seeing any. Awesome. 48 out of 51 or 0 out of 51. Draw, discard. I'm not quite sure what those mean. Right. All shotgun ones there, didn't we? Yeah, this is all a bit hard to follow, I'll be honest. Wait here and then up arrow to heal me. There you go. I really like the fact that you've got like healing in there as well, though. That's nice. Oh, we got like a, a random, completely luck based thing there. We got a lot of regen there. Um. I, I, I just got killed. I don't, this this guy is strange. <laughs> I'm really enjoying it, but god damn is it weird. God damn is it weird. One second. Right, let's keep it going. Let's try again. Yeah, this guy, it seems like we there's, there's some times where we can just die. Um, one of the abilities did say about that, so... It was like a 1 in 6 chance to just kill yourself, or... Uh, like, chance to kill everything on the map and get a legendary item, so. It's called Russian Roulette, rightfully so. This is just like that one hyper shot, isn't it? That I missed. Wow. Oh my god. Explosive shot's great. Um, Piggy Bank's probably pretty good early on. That's money over time, right? Oh, Bricks open at the start of the next stage. That's actually still pretty good. Not really what I was hoping for, though. Some regular shots here. I thought that was the money over time, then. I, I guess, like, I think with this character, you can learn them to be reasonably effective but I think at the minute for us it's gonna be basically all entirely random we're just gonna be at the whim of the game I'm not sure what the numbers mean on uh, on draw and discard I'll be honest I don't know how to play poker or any card game for that matter so could mean anything to me. So uh, some of these things might be going right over my head, I'll be honest. Right, let's hope we can get a few more items here. <laughs> I just love how aggressive that uh that explosion is. It's hilarious. Um, it's official size, but not official weight. I mean, I used it on that enemy and it just died. Also, I see you there, invisible enemy. I've got a few invisible enemies on me, actually. You see? I told you. I used the wrong one, bollocks, and I just died. 
Wow, this is really strange. Yeah, it doesn't seem like it affects anything whether I pick skills or not. I've got to be really careful about what, what cards I use. I used the wrong one there and I died. I don't know if that was the card that killed me or if it, or if it was the Elder Mala Malarian. Malarian. Lamarian. He has malaria. Stay back. But even if we have a, a few dud runs with this guy, I enjoy them nonetheless because with, with this series and with this mod list, it's all about just trying new things. It's all about just trying out these classes that are a bit weird, wacky, and wonderful and seeing what happens. Ooh, we've got two at once there. We've got two of these hyper shots lined up, apparently. That's pretty fun. I think it's just the shot from the sniper, honestly. Oh! What the fuck? I don't know what's happened here. What on earth happened? Am I gonna die? What is going on? Is that an overloading worm? Am I fucked? I feel like I'm probably fucked. Okay. I got a legendary item. I also died again. <laughs> this is... Oh my lord. I have absolutely zero contemplation of what is happening. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sure there's some better way of knowing how to play this character. I do not have that knowledge, but I am going to try regardless. Right. A new world, a new dawn to explore. Let's see how it shall go. Some of these abilities are a bit crazy. Also, like, our starting damage is just so pathetic. It's a really interesting concept for a character, though, this. I feel like the instant death mechanics are a bit, uh, iffy. But I suppose if you're gonna go with random roulette, it's part of the charm, I guess. I've also got very little money thus far. I'm not sure what that does. Where's all our money going? How do we have so little money? This is truly an experience. I just want to open this chest. It's been forever. How have I not got enough for this yet? Wowee. How have I, how have I not got enough? One second. Right, sorry about all the pauses. Come on, enemies, where are you? There's you, at least. Okay. We got a chest. Huzzah! Honestly, increased health regen sounds absolutely dandy to me. Give me that heal. Jump in the air for me. And the heal comes back again. Is that like our best way of healing? It might well be. More gold, more damage. Pretty decent. Not super applicable right now, but... I missed all of those. Oh, come on. That guy gave me like one gold. Using your equipment heals you. Thank you. Explosions for you all. It happened again. Oh my goodness. Kill Killing marked enemies permanently increases damage. Okay, that's pretty good. Do I know which ones the marked enemies are? What are they marked with? Or do I have to mark them? Oh god. Oh, 
Oh, for God's sake, I'm dead again. <laughs> this is just bizarre. Like, how do you avoid death as this character? I can't imagine completing a run as this guy. I'm still really enjoying, like, exploring this dude. I mean, like I said, it's all about exploration and finding stuff out. But this guy is tricky as shit to, like, figure out. He is not the sort of character you'd ever normally see in a game like this. A hey, 25 exactly. Big boy. Let's go. Hurt nearby enemies. That's actually pretty good because now we have a way of not firing. And I like that. That's pretty darn useful for us. Now it's two. going to give us a... Is that a heal? Oh, it's extra regen, I see. Up arrow. I don't know what up arrow does. Mouse 2 is, uh, I don't know. This is he uh, health regen again. I don't know what mouse 2 is here again. Give it a go. Fire up our cast into the air and the permanent enemies. Pretty good. Big chest, I see you. There's our full heal. Okay, so I'm, I'm starting to understand some of the cards now. Invisible guy here. Killed me again. Holy shit, this is the most deaths you'll ever see in an episode. Wow. This is just really something. I, I, I'm determined. Determined to, like, get a decent run going as this character. I'm going to give it until we hit at least 20 minutes. I don't like to put out a video that's ever less than 20 minutes. I feel like I've, I feel like I've cheated you if I do that. Okay, hello. You have become whatever this is. Are you, are you just invincible now? What, what, what is this? Like, do I want to be spamming abilities? To, it's, it's difficult. I don't know, like, should I be avoiding abilities at all costs and using them, like, literally only when I have to, like, when I've run out of ammo? Or should I be using them all the damn time? I finally killed that enemy. Bye, Felicia. We've generated a few of these guys, and I'll be honest, they scare me. Hey, okay, healed just at the right time there. We got a chest here already, good. Hey, we got bunny hops. I died again. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm not even sure what ability it is that keeps killing me. Whatever it is, I need to stop using it. There's only some abilities that yeah, like I should be allowed to use here. Cause <laughs> Oh, this guy's wacky. What a strange fella. Like it's such a it's it's kind of interesting. It's such a bold decision to like have a character that's just able to kill themselves so easily. And it's also a really, like, bold decision to tie your ammo, um, tie your ability to shoot to using your abilities. Right, so, ah, is it this one? It's not that one. And this is a chance-based thing, then. Maybe it is. Queen, mouse two. That is two of these loaded. R is throwing up the cards. Another two of these loaded, lovely. Let's chop over there, we'll go check that out. I'm gonna keep these two loaded for a big boy. We got here. This is good, isn't it? That's a shoot extra unpredictable shots, yeah, there you go. A bit of a waste on those, but that's fine. Didn't mean to use that one. I took off half my health, I think. Attack spread to nearby enemies. I like the idea of that. So there's the healing. Our ability... Our ability seems to just be a reload. With a, with a snake shot in it. 
Oh, that just took away all my money. What's this one? It's got like an ice shot in it, maybe? Oh, it was a shotgun shot, I think. Whatever that is. And that gave us one of these extra power shots. I'm going to snipe this guy with... Ah, bugger. That's just going to load us up with random shots. Nice. This R ability, again, is pretty pretty valuable. It's basically a reload. Yeah, that one's pretty good. That one's pretty basic. Okay, this is one we don't know either. Try and learn what this one does. Ah. That was the extra health regen. Okay. That hurt me. That healed me back up. Mouse 2. Try that one out. Up arrow again for the health regen. So this, this up arrow one here. Um, what's this going to be? That is... I don't know actually. It's very tricky. Okay. Didn't realize we got monster teeth at some point, but that's useful. Right, where's our boss at? Our boss is over there. Let's just go do the boss. Let's try and get to a second stage, shall we? I like that connecting damage. That's really nice. Keep actually using the wrong skills. Slightly annoying. Okay. This one seems like one of the ones that might be able to kill me. I'm just going to do it and see. It didn't. It must just be a luck sort of thing there. We don't know. Oh god, I'm just going to die to this enemy now, aren't I? God damn it, he broke my watch. Yeah, I'm dead again. Wow, this has been quite the experience. If anyone knows how to play this character, do clue me in, because I'd be interested to know. But this is... Yeah, this guy's strange. I hope you guys enjoyed that nonetheless. It was kind of more of a showcase than a real episode, because we died a lot. Either way, quite a bit of fun. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.